it is going to uh, accelerate in uh, the next days uh, or next week. March was the month of COVID suppression and vaccine acceleration, enabling the city to delay the third wave, says Montreal Public Health. But more cases are on the way. Variants represent 42 percent of new cases in the city. Montreal with 299 of the province's new cases Wednesday. First time in a week, new cases are under 300. Currently, 142 outbreaks in Montreal, but public health calling them small and under control. Today, there are 265 patients in the hospital, including 71 in intensive care unit. In senior residents, the situation is good. In the past week, there were only one new outbreaks in CHSLD and one in senior residence. The healthcare system is feeling the pressure as more patients are younger and fight the virus longer. We also know that Montreal is more vulnerable, so when the variant is there, uh, knowing the urban context, we are more, uh, we, we know that it can go on fire more easily, and that it, that it is more, uh, it is harder to control the transmission when it's, uh, it's in place. 86% of those 80 and older have received the vaccine. Starting Thursday, seven vaccination sites will be designated as walk-in sites for those 55 years and over who wish to get the AstraZeneca vaccine. Montreal will be the first city in the province to do so. I really want to say to the Montreal population that it is a good vaccine for your group age, it is secure, and it is uh, effective to uh, prevent severe form of the illness, and it is effective against the variant, the UK variant, so uh, uh, at a population, at, for individually and at a population level, I do recommend that people go and uh, get this vaccine as soon as possible. In Montreal, Melina Jubilaro, City. City News.